These tiny hands are taking part in this Italian ritual. Well, sort of. It is fun. Nearly 100 children from 4 to 10 years old pick up the mini Giglio by the wooden beams, then walk and dance down the street outside Our Lady of Mount Carmel Church. There's more little kids lifting it, so they really need the bigger kids' help. This structure is much smaller compared to the famous Giglio, which is 72 feet tall and weighs 4 tons. The one the children lift is 20 feet and 200 pounds, leading the pint-sized lifters of the Capos, who take turns cueing the band and giving four commands. While a young in English, they mean listen up, on your shoulders, steady, and throw it. I felt pretty good, a little nervous. I was really happy to command a lot of people and also speaking over the microphone. Carrying the Giglio is a tradition for many families. These kids watch their parents and grandparents carry the original, and now they're the ones being watched. It's a great feeling to see them the next generation of capos, or lifters actually, and uh, it was just heartwarming. There are really no words that describe when you see your grandchild underneath the Giglio, especially at his age, four years old. He's already so into the Giglio. And as much as these youngsters enjoy lifting this smaller Giglio, they already have their minds set on following footsteps. And eventually one day I could be a number one capo on the big Giglio. Just want to stay involved in the feast, do everything that they did. When I'm older, I'm going to lift. And, and when I'm an old man, I'm going to be a capo. But for now, these kids will have to stand on the sidelines and watch as the big Giglio dances on Sunday, beginning at 2 p.m. Reporting for Currents from Williamsburg, I'm Tim Harfman.